Wanted to do a little Rushton history lesson, this one focusing on the tag design for the rubber faces, starting with this earliest tag design that just is super simple and says the Rushton Company. This is from the early 50s. And from what I understand, it's from before the company named this line of toys because the Rushton Company made several different toy lines. Um, and before they coined the Rushton Star Creation line, which it went on to be called until the company ended in the early 80s. But this tag that I'm showing you right now is the classic shooting star design that the company uses through the mid, maybe even late 60s. And this one has the little hang tag that goes along with this era of the toy company. It's super cute. This one's really marked up. Um, I think it was given to someone as a gift, but it's super cute. I love the illustrations. Um, something else I wanted to point out about this tag design is just looking through my own personal collection that there's several different little numbers or letters indicated on the tags and I think this is probably indicative of different print runs or potentially different factories that were making the different toys but I do love that like this one for instance doesn't have any little additional marking on the label but it's just super fun i love stuff like that um i'm gonna show you guys a few more examples of these like this one's a very very early one but it still has a little four and this guy's got the b this one's got an a um i just love seeing stuff like that on toys if anyone knows what that is specifically let me know so the next tag design is i believe from the late 60s maybe early 70s and it's this version of the tag and you can see it starts to list its contents this one has cotton or rubber but the most interesting note for me is that the tag now says that it's made from all new materials and then this guy i'm assuming is from around the same time like getting into maybe the early 70s but has different it's a really beat up tag but it has a different uh, materials contents listing it's polyurethane and expanded styrene and you can kind of tell that it's later based on the type of fur that it has and it, it does feel like pretty different when you squish them this guy that i sold recently has the same tag design but just in blue color also cotton and expanded styrene so i'm going to date it to about the same time early mid 1970s this one has the latest tag design i've had come through my personal collection um I want to say this is from the late 70s, maybe even early 80s. I know that once we get into about 1983, they changed their tag design, but this is the last one I have for you guys.